Hello, VMware user group in St. Louis. I wanted to say that I'm deeply thankful for our partnership. Now I'm going to tell you a little bit about VMware's proposition. It all starts with the core DNA of engines that fuel VMware. Innovation and customer obsession. That's what's fueled us the last 20 years, and that's what's going to fuel us for the next 20 years. Customer obsession, we've been very fortunate to be among the top companies, top five companies, to consistently score the highest in NPS. Innovation, let me tell you a little bit about the way you can think about our product portfolio. It all starts with apps being at the core of everything that infrastructure supports. And in the data center, we start with software defining compute storage networking and layering management on top of that. I sometimes describe it like baking a cake where you've, you have flour, eggs, sugar, and icing on top of it. That's really kind of what like a data center is. So as you take a software defined approach, you are able to reduce cost, you're able to reduce complexity, reduce carbon, and now you make yourself more agile for the potential move to the hybrid cloud. So the entire world of a data center moving to the cloud is what we would call the hybrid cloud journey. You can't achieve this hybrid cloud journey without networking. And software defined networking is the core of what VMware's differentiation is in that entire networking stack. And we've really focused on not just the data center, but the data center to the cloud and to the branch with new areas like SD-WAN, with our acquisition of VeloCloud that every one of you should take note of. Once you're in the cloud, you start to realize it's not just a single cloud, it's a multi-cloud world. And uh, this is where you need tools like Cloud Health to help you manage the resources and cost of a multi-cloud world, whether it's on top of AWS or Azure or Google or IBM or many other VMware clouds. And our goal is to be that indispensable infrastructure that stretches from the on-premise world through private cloud to sitting even on top of multi-clouds. You realize as you do build these apps now in a multi-cloud world, it's not just traditional apps, but modern apps that are built on Kubernetes. And VMware is making a big bet on Kubernetes. We acquired Heptio, uh, we've partnered with Pivotal, we're creating PKS and Essential PKS. The whole idea is to make not just the notion of VMware as you know it, but these sort of ads that you see containerware, where in essence, the containers are really almost as important as VMs, and the same company that brought you the virtual machine can, will, and can and will bring you that enterprise container platform that becomes the standard for a multi-cloud world. That's the fourth priority. And fifth, and probably one of the parts that's close to, still close to my heart because I ran that business for a good part of VM, my early years at VMware, is end user computing in the digital workspace. Our goal there is to allow, whether it's desktop or moving to a mobile world, for you to have a single digital workspace that allows you to work at the speed of life so you get any app on any device, whether it's Apple device, iOS or Mac, or Google device, Android or Chrome, or a Windows 10 um, laptop of any hardware manufacturer, Dell, HP, Lenovo. And we're the only company that can bring that unified digital workspace, Workspace ONE, now to life Consolidating all these plethora of technologies, VDI, mobile management, identity management, and all of that into one unified solution. So that, my friends, is the way in which we think about our portfolio, the way I tell my story in a few minutes if I had time with the CIO. I would like every one of you, our user group professionals, to pick an area outside of what you know very well. Maybe you know us well for vSphere, but maybe you want to now become an expert in hyperconverged infrastructure where we're now number one or in networking with NSX, or in our multi-cloud abilities with Cloud Health, or in our hybrid cloud capabilities of VMware Cloud on AWS, or in our Kubernetes capabilities, what we're doing with Heptio and other tools, or in, of course, the digital workspace, Workspace ONE. Pick a new area, become an expert at it, and we're deeply grateful for all of the many years of our partnership. We owe so much to our user groups, and this video is a small token of my gratitude to every one of you for all that you've done for, uh, for us for many years to come, uh, in the past, and I know our partnership and friendship will last for many years to come. Thank you very much.